Hi guys, Julia here with Decor Lab. Have you seen displays with boards, pedestals, and other backdrops and thought to yourself that they might be so expensive? Well, to tell the truth, they can get expensive if you are paying to someone else to make them. But guess what? You can totally make these items yourself for a fraction of the cost. And if you're totally new to using the tools of the woodworking, that's okay. In this video, we will introduce you to some of the basic tools that you can start with that will help you to craft your own decor pieces. And believe it or not, you do not need a tons of expensive tools. We made our first marquee ladders in our basement with just a jigsaw. And those were the start of the great business. So if we could do this, so can you. So speaking of the jigsaw, this is the first tool we are going to talk about. If you're going to make only a few simple cuts and only want to buy one saw, this is the one to get. You can buy a jigsaw for under $100 and use it for both straight cuts and curved cuts. Of course, it might be not as efficient like those fancy expensive saws, but it's cheap and it gets the job done. Next up, if you are going to be cutting things, you probably want to measure it first. So another important tool here is the tape measure. If you need to make straight cuts, a large metal rule can come in handy. It will help you to mark and measure your cuts. You might be tempted to skip this, but they will be very helpful to keep one large piece of wood in place when you're making your cuts. You can get adjustable trigger clamps like this or just some simple spring clamps. Either will get the job done. And as a bonus, the spring clamps can also be very useful to hold your decor in place. So we talked about a jigsaw, clamps, and a ruler. All of these things will help you to make a cut. But what about connecting things together? If you don't already have one, it is a good idea to invest into a power drill. This will make drilling holes and screwing pieces together such a breeze. A pro tip here, always pre-drill a hole before putting a screw in. This will help you to prevent splitting of the wood. So now you got your pieces cut and you got them put together. Now what? Painting supplies. Having some sandpaper to smooth out the rough edges, always a good idea. Then getting a paintbrush or roller will help you to paint most of the pieces. And do not forget that you can repaint most of the pieces multiple times to match any theme. And that's all you need to get started. Under $200, you can get all of the basic tools that will help you to start building your own decor pieces. If you would like to learn more about building your own decor pieces, we have tons of different tutorials inside of our online membership school. Inside of Decor Lab, we show you step-by-step -step tutorials on how to build things like KR boards, five bases, and many other things. We also include a list of tools and materials with links so you have all of the information in one place. So go to decorlabschool.com to become a member today. And I will see you in the next video.